Hey guys, it's Jenna with Go Do You. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a review on one of my favorite travel and photography bags. Let's go. One thing I've noticed about living the adventure lifestyle is the biggest part is having great gear to support your needs. And the number one item you're likely going to bring on all your adventures is a great bag. Now I haven't found a bag that fits all types of trips, but I have found one that's been really helpful lately. It's called a Wander Provoke 21 liter backpack. It's great for outdoor adventure and fits perfectly as a carry-on bag. The key features that stand out are the materials, size, and design. In taking a closer look at the materials, you'll notice that it's water resistant, which is great for waterfalls and rainy weather, durable and long lasting, protects your camera, is comfortable after a long time, and is easy to clean. The 21 liter is the perfect size for a carry-on bag, and you can add to its size by extending the roll top. The camera cube fits oddly shaped gear, such as a crane, very well, and it's great for keeping all of your gear together versus having multiple bags. It sits perfectly on the back, and there is a 31 liter option as well. The design is unique, organized, has custom options, and was made by fellow adventure addicts just like you. Let's take a closer look. The first thing you'll notice is that the look doesn't call attention. And the material is water resistant and easy to clean. The bag comes in blue or black and can stand easily on its own. It sits perfectly on the back. and each side has a clip area for adding things to the outside of the bag. The larger side pocket zips open to extend for larger water bottles and the back is lined with cushion for comfort and shock absorbency which makes it comfortable but yet protective at the same time. There's a small pocket on the back that can be used for money, travel documents, cards, and passports. and the zipper can be tucked away even farther to discourage theft. The side pockets are designed in a similar manner and are great for things like keys, cell phones, and snacks. Both sides have extra clasps, which are great for maximizing your gear. One side even opens up with full access to your camera or other belongings. It has its own interior pocket with a zipper for those small things you need quick access to but don't want to lose. And inside the zippered pockets are more compartments to organize even farther. You'll find the material to be stretchy yet supportive. It's so easy to use the side access to grab my camera when I'm out and about and I love it. It makes a huge difference to be hands-free when you need to. And you can get right back to what you're doing when you're done. Even using the bag over one shoulder, you still get the full support and easy access. It really is great for so many things, no matter how you're using the bag. The roll top opens up so you can add more inside and extend your space. To keep it secure, no matter the size, there are a number of spots to put the clasp. On the front, there is another pocket that is thin, but great for extra papers and items you want close at hand. On the bottom, you will find yet another pocket that is used to house the rain jacket, which fits perfectly over the top of the bag. And secures around the back. You may also remove the jacket to use the pocket for other small items. When it opens up, everything stays in its place and you will see there is a spot for a laptop or tablet as well. Even that area has a Velcro strap to hold it in. To get to the camera bag, you just unzip the bottom and pop it out. There is a separate compartment on the top or you may break the bag down to one compartment. 
There is another pocket along the edge as well. I'll be showing you how I pack this bag out in my next video, so stay tuned. Now let's take a closer look at the removable camera bag. It has easy pull tabs, and a handle rests on top for easy carry. Inside you'll find movable dividers that can be velcroed down so you can organize the inside of your bag. I like to separate out my batteries, accessories, cords, camera, and gimbal, and I'll show you how in my next video. It's lined with a felt-like material, and the side opens up just like the backpack does. But holds sturdy and doesn't feel like it's going to fall apart. It's great for accessing your camera or other gear and fits perfectly so it actually works. On the bottom of the backpack, there is a Velcro patch to secure the inner bag from moving around. Now let's take a look at the extra straps. The larger straps are padded and are for your waist. They'll support you in long distances and heavier loads. To use them, just open the clip on the end and attach them to the loopholes at the bottom of each side of the bag. They take some getting used to, but once you get the hang of it, are great to use. Once secured, they come together in the center with a large buckle clasp and both sides can be adjusted to fit. One side has an extra zipper and pocket for carrying more items. To adjust the height of the pack, there are two additional straps on each side. Now let's take a look at the thinner straps. The clasps are the same as the larger straps, and they can be secured to the front of the pack. You may adjust them based on your load size. Or secure them in an X fashion as well. This was a huge selling point for me because I always like to carry a water bottle and a tripod but still want access to the inside of the bag. You can also use the straps along the bottom of the bag. And again, you can use them parallel or crossed. This is where I typically carry my tripod, but it can also be used for yoga mats, as you see here, or really anything you want to place there. And then lastly, they can be used to hold your pack open for a workspace or easy access. This works by wearing the pack on your front and attaching the straps, as you see here. They're really easy to adjust and quite durable, so you don't have to worry about them breaking. Speaking of straps, you can see here that the main pack straps are nice and thick and have quite a few useful loops on them. On top there is a handle for easy carry and it secures with a magnet. Overall, it's a really useful bag and I highly recommend it. If you're looking to buy it, just head on over to their website and take a look at their package options. I'll leave a link down below. I hope you enjoyed the review and I'll see you next time.